More than 4,000 people have now died in the Ebola outbreak, according to new figures, as international warnings get even louder. In a sign of how seriously the United States is taking this issue, New York's John F. K. Kennedy Airport is now starting to screen passengers for Ebola. Passengers from affected countries in West Africa will have their temperatures taken and will be asked to answer questionnaires as they enter the country. The Centers for Disease Control and prevention says the screening is just one part of an overall Thank strategy to fight the spread of Ebola. Officials say it will be rolled out to four other airports next week. Meanwhile, a national exercise to test Britain's readiness for an Ebola outbreak will take place on Saturday. The eight-hour operation was ordered by British Prime Minister David Cameron.